just taking an interest in the beautiful sculpture that you've got there. Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we're just near East Midlands Airport and we've come across a games workshop headquarters or warehouse. But we've all seen these games workshop little shops in our local shopping centres and I'll pop a, an image on the screen right now just to remind you. Warhammer 40,000 it says on that main screen. But yeah, little characters. Um, what would you class them as, Jay? Would you class them as toys or...? Um, no, the like... Collectibles? Yeah, sort of. But they've got a lovely sculpture down there. So yeah, you, when you put this uh, beautiful sculpture sort of thing, you're bound to get people showing an interest in it. Wonder what it is? It looks like it's a gun pointing this way. But I'd love to get closer to that, to get a proper shot of that one. But yeah, it looks like we're looking down the barrel of a gun there, doesn't it? We are looking down the barrel of a gun, I think. I wonder if they strategically pointed it to this entrance. I don't know. Possibly. You want to bump into him on a dark night down an alleyway, would you? <laughs> so yeah, one interesting thing about this place, they've got an app. So it's called the, uh, the Warhammer 40,000. They even says they've got a community as well. So yeah, it's, they really are um, making themselves bigger and bigger, this Games Workshop. It used to just be a shop in the shopping centre. Yeah. Now it's more of like an online community and getting everyone involved. So yeah, interesting little place. They've just left us alone. We've been standing out here for a while, but uh, yeah, just left us alone. So no problem with this place at all. So this is about as close as I can get to the, um, the special figure statue but how amazing is that eh you games workshop fans will know exactly what that is yeah what's it called what that's one of them i think so all oh, right okay hello mate you're right just taking an interest in the beautiful sculpture that you've got there. Yeah, yeah. Is that the Warhammer 40,000? Yes. All oh, right. Roger. Not many people know that's there. Yeah, it's just a warehouse. Yeah. You but to lend it, I presume if you know enough about it, you know where it is. No, no. We actually came to see DHL. Yeah. But because that's there, the Games Workshop. So is this just a warehouse where they store stuff and ship it out? Well, we do, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's still in the process of starting. So it's not established yet. Why? Why does it need to be so close to the East Midlands Airport? What? So the export on the. Where's the rail from here? So you actually does Games Workshop actually use the the railway? All oh, right. Okay. So is is a railway for inland um, movement around rather than putting stuff on the road? So export using yeah. export via sea using the well, rail. But did you come in along the way? I didn't notice it, mate. But I'm coming along the way. Just before you get to the end, there's an island on the left. Go down there and you'll see where the rail goes. Just over the ramp. Massive container terminal. That's just for ease. This is yeah. right. So just while we're on this East Midlands Parkway, we just spotted this, and look, a container is being lifted right now with some sort of telehandler with a big grab arm so I've never seen that before so he, he locates himself on the uh, four corners and he lifts it up as easy as that and these will be absolutely rammed full of goods because this is where it joins onto um, the railway on the cargo freight trains as you see down there all the containers waiting on the tracks on the trailers ready to be pulled away and you've got hundreds and hundreds of containers. When you pick them containers, it looks small from here, 
But when you get close to them, you'll really see the sheer scale of how big it is. Yeah, you've got the little um, 20 foot containers down there, and then one, uh, then one's a 40 foot containers down there. So this was all purpose built for all these businesses to, to use the rail network to take some of the load off the motorways. <laughs> yeah, you've got uh, quite a lot of activity going on as they're moving all the containers around. But, so the, the location for, because I was speaking to DHL about this and that their reason for being here is because of the, the local to the air hub that they've got. But is your, is, was that a factor in, in them choosing this as well yeah. or just the rail? Right, both, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's really good, ain't it? Yeah. But I bet it, this sort of place would cost a fortune. <laughs> How long has it been operational? About 18 months, that's all. It's not on It's not on fully. Yeah. Because we're YouTubers, and obviously this now, this statue now, will get in front of a lot of viewers. Yeah. So you might have a few more people coming down to have a look at it, but... It's no problem, is it? It's just an interest that they've got and it's going to yeah. spread the word. Yeah. All publicity is good publicity, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, no problem, mate. Nice to meet you anyway. Okay. Thank you. Right. So, yeah, what a pleasant gentleman. It is the Warhammer 40,000, as Jay said. And now you do know where to come and view it if you want. <laughs> I've never seen a, a statue that big on a, a Games Workshop character. But yeah, if you've enjoyed that one, guys, press the thumbs up and we'll see you on the next one. From Games Workshop Group PLC at East Midlands Parkway. Bye-bye for now.